Hello my dear Sagittarius, how are you? Welcome to your reading. My name is Sabbath. Welcome to Sabbath Tarot. I'm very happy to see you with me. Sagittarius, we're going to be doing your reading for the month of February. And let's see, Spirit, what is happening for Sagittarius for the month of February? Feel free to check out your Venus, your rising and your moon sign, as well as your sun sign to find the readings that most resonate with you on my channel. I knew it. That ladybug was flipped and I put it back and here it is. So you cut the ladybug. Sagittarius, you could be seeing ladybugs. All right, it's maybe in your surroundings out of nowhere. Hey, there's a lot of good luck. A lot of good luck here coming through. So let's see what it says. You're a bright energy. Let worry go and be happy here and now. Feel good about being a loving and colorful you. You bless the world with color and good luck. Aww. The spirit here is really complimenting you, Sagittarius, I feel. The spirit wants for you to know that you're beautiful just as you are. That you are enough, okay? You are worthy of so much that you are being watched over that you are being cared for and protected at all times even though sometimes you might forget right and i truly feel like it's time for you to live your life the way you want sagittarius to not hold back anymore to not be worried about the consequences of things or what other people have to say or who thinks what is what i'm hearing for you such colorful energy spirit here is telling you you have a lot of color within you. You could have a lot of love within you, a lot of affection. You know, some of you I'm hearing you could be touchy. You want to, you know, touch and you want to hug people. Um, maybe you smile. You have a beautiful smile. But all this energy is speaking of is that you do not have to hold your energy back whatsoever. Okay. Um, who knows? Maybe you are, you know, going into environments in which you feel more comfortable to be yourself in you know and this also could be people's company now we're going to do your tarot and see what's going on for you Sagittarius Whew. you guys if you hear me whisper I'm actually recording this around maybe 2 a.m <laughs> I like uh, midnight readings better to be honest I mean I like doing reads all the time but you know it's just different Kind of energy for such spirit. What is the energy for the month of February? Wow, we have the Ten of Cups, and I have to <laughs> cover this. Excuse me, Ten of Cups, Six of Pentacles. Oh my goodness, all systems go. And at the bond decree here, we have the Knight of Cups, Heavens. And the sun, you guys. Wow. So, you're getting lucky. You are getting lucky, Sagittarius. There could be definitely a lot of love here that's coming through for you. Okay, this speaks of affection. This speaks of offers. Um, but I feel like you're going to completely be blown away. You see how this wave is shaped? It's like a really huge wave that's going to just like surprise you with its energy, with its love, right? Now, I do feel like there's something very emotional coming up for you, Sagittarius. This could be a connection that's coming together. Not gonna lie. It feels good. There's a strong water energy coming through. You could be connecting with Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. We have Libra and Earth coming through as well. I feel like your love life is just going to get going, right? I don't know if you've been experiencing some kind of a stagnation or if you've been feeling like your love life has been on hold. But to me, it feels like you're going to just get going. You're going to be experiencing fairness, Sagittarius, when it comes to your life, when it comes to what you deserve and this is Libra energy speaking of balance coming through for you. I'm tapping onto a very, very kind energy, okay? 
you could be a very, very empathic person. Even when things happen, you don't look for revenge. You are not vengeful. You're a type of person, you take revenge by leveling up, right? That's such a fiery energy anyways. That's something a fire sign would do, I feel. And all this energy is speaking of is that there's good karma and that you're stepping into new energy you are going to be experiencing justice, okay, and fairness within your life, especially within your love life is something I'm hearing for you, Sagittarius. Now, I'm going to tap onto who this person is coming through because I see a very, very strong energy here. And there could be travels. There could be dates coming up. I see someone really pursuing you. I see someone really wanting to take action your way okay but we'll see and it's a very reciprocal energy too with some of you i feel like there could be a very lucky connection like you could feel like you're very lucky to have found this person and vice versa you feel like you've never met such a person that you're lucky about you know isn't that so heavenly i feel like it's such a sweet and adorable energy you might have not felt that way you know in, in a long time but let's see, who is this person stepping through for Sagittarius spirit? It could be a Pisces or have Pisces within their chart. Fire as well as coming through, okay? And Earth. I feel like it could be rather of a new or recent energy you take as it resonates, okay? Or it could be that you're slowly getting to know this person. You could be wanting to take things slow. You could be wanting to take your time to get to know this person to have rather of a deeper connection with them. You know, maybe you're starting off as friends. Maybe you're, you know, wanting to get to know each other on a friendship level and then escalate things. Um, again, it doesn't have to be that, okay? But yeah, with the Three of Pentacles and the Four of Cups, I feel like for some of you, this person <laughs> um, could feel like you have options. You have a lot of options. They could want to want something really stable with you, or it could be that this person wants to keep you all to them, okay? It's the kind of energy that I'm seeing. This person could really take their time with you, okay? As much as they do want to rush things, I do feel like you two could be taking your time to get to know each other. I keep hearing that for some reason. Um, maybe some of you are practicing self-control. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness and it's so hard to be honest it is really hard now let me see here you could be very sexy to this person that's something i'm noticing you could be very very attractive to this person's eyes okay and some of you i'm also hearing that people notice your beauty when you two go out that's so interesting what i'm hearing <laughs> perhaps people think that you two are a couple Wow, you guys see how my ring is actually matching that um, card? That's so pretty. Anyway, I feel like this person really thinks about you intimately, you know, and sexually. Just saying, okay? To the point where, you know, this person might, you know, blush when they're around you or like when you are around them, when you touch them. I just see this energy. It's, it's, it's really cute. <laughs> okay. Now, what's going to be happening for Sagittarius? I keep hearing abundance. I keep hearing that word for you in my head. Abundance, abundance, abundance. And this could be emotional abundance. This could be something that you might have been wanting for such a long time and desiring and longing for. Finally, given to you. Okay? Gifted to you. Now, what is going to be happening for the future? Wow, six of wands, such heavenly energy. You've got an offer coming through, you guys. You've got an offer, Sagittarius. Nine of Pentacles, the four of wands. It could be that someone here wants to be in a committed relationship with you. They could be definitely breaking it to you. They could be going for that question. They could be saying the first, I love you. Maybe... This person is definitely offering you, you know, or confessing to you, but this is something I'm predicting for you, okay? I feel like you, you're you going to have the choice to be in a relationship, a committed one. So I don't know if you're single right now or if you're planning to stay single. That's totally your choice as free will. But I feel like you're going to have the 
why am I hearing privilege? <laughs> You're going to have the choice, you know, to be in a committed relationship with someone. Or it could be that that is a possibility for you. Um, some of you could really communicate online with this person. Or maybe you've met online to guess resonates. Doesn't have to be. Someone could also work online, all right, or have a business, or maybe they're into arts or sports. Um, yeah, but overall, I feel like you're gonna really enjoy your time for this month onwards. You know, I really see you being loved and appreciated and putting yourself in that energy of warmth, all right, surrounding yourself with this energy. Now, do we have any love messages for Sagittarius Spirit? Any love messages do we have for Sagittarius Spirit? What does Sagittarius need to hear? Oh my goodness. Let your friends help you. This could be the one. Some of your friends could know this person. Or maybe their friends talk about you. There's that kind of an energy here. Do we have one more card? And make the effort yeah so that's something I always say the amount of energy we put in we receive you know if you're connecting with someone and they show very little effort they put very little effort they're only gonna get little from you or maybe nothing from you right I feel like this person that you're connecting with who could be the one, Sagittarius, because the cards are saying, all right, you've already met the romantic partner you seek. They're going to show it to you that they want you, that they love you. They're going to prove it to you. They're going to put in the effort. They will be there for you, okay? They don't want to lose you. And that's when you know someone truly loves you, when they don't want to lose you, when they don't put themselves in a situation to lose you, right? And yeah, I feel like it's so interesting because I'm hearing the word patience and it could also be that, you know, a lot of the times when someone takes their time with us, they're not, you know, wanting to rush things. Um, they want to get to know us deeper on a deeper level, on a deeper level. They ask questions. Um, they ask about how we are and about our future and whatever the case maybe they simply spend time with us that's when you know they really care right so this is what the energy that i see here coming through for you sagittarius who knows maybe you're you know really prioritizing this energy of who puts in the effort most for me just saying okay that's a very very important message right there any angel messages do we have for sagittarius Oh my god, this card. Wow. Yes. <laughs> so let's read this beautiful card for you, Sagittarius. Healer of thought. Air energy. It's time to clean up your life. Get rid of anything that clutters your space or makes you disorganized. People who... Did, look at this. Hear me out. People who take from you but don't give back should be released as well, just like I was telling you. You or another person involved in this situation is wise, insightful, and caring, has a wonderful sense of humor, and offers a lot of life experience. So all this is saying is that perhaps you're becoming more aware, okay, in regards to the choices you're making, and what type of energy you're allowing in your space and that you're not, you know, letting people waste your time. That's what I'm saying. You're not letting people waste your time because you know that your time is valuable and your energy is valuable, okay? So this is all I have for you, my dear Sagittarius. What a wonderful, magical reading. I hope that this helps you. Do like, share, and subscribe to my channel. I would be really happy to have you here and I'm doing personal readings. If you would like one with me, write to me simply to my email, okay? It's in the description box below, and you can also follow me on my new channel, Sista, and my Instagram page, all right? I'm sending my kiss. Mm -hmm. My warm embrace and my love and light, Sagittarius. Bye-bye, darling.